All right, guys, last time I did it in my right thigh, so I'm going to do it in my left thigh this time. Okay. All right, guys, I'm taking off the cap. I'm going to unlock it. See here? Okay. All right, here we go. In my left thigh. All right, third injection is done. All right, guys, third injection is complete. I will let you know how I'm doing. Again, I've been still taking the magnesium, those seven when I showed you, um, probably about every few days. It's been keeping me kind of going. I want to tell you really quick about what happened. I was kind of updated on Walgreens and Walmart. But I just want you to know, you know when Walgreens faxed over my order to Walmart? They told the pharmacist that my car was no good. Like, because they couldn't fill it, why did they need to tell Walmart any issues with my car? Thank goodness um, they were able to run it themselves and they haven't found an issue other than the things that I told you about that they said I can't get it until the 18th. But it just seems real petty that Walgreens felt the need to let them know that the reason why they denied it and why they um, and the car that I'm sending over to them was no good. Anyway, so, so sad. Anyway, going forward, um, it's a new week. I'm trying to increase my protein. It's a little hard, um, but this is dose three. I'm hoping to get my new refill. But I, um, you know, I'm looking forward to the five milligrams that'll be starting. I got one more dose of the 2.5. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> so you'll see, I insert, I'm going to insert my weight. So I was actually down on my weight. So 2.4 pounds this week. So 2.6 last week, 2.4, actually five pounds total. You know, I was wondering, like, I oh, don't know, that's not good. Some people are losing eight, nine in one week, and this is two weeks. But, you know, I just reminded myself, I did tell you, I share with you guys about my inches and that, you know, how that was going. And listen, a win is a win, right? So I'm going to go with that. A win is a win because that's still 2.4 pounds this week, which is a healthy amount of weight to lose each week. And I definitely can see it, guys. Listen, I am feeling so good in my clothes. I, I can just tell you, I can tell the difference. So, you know, for me, I know that I lose weight. It's hard for me to lose weight. So just the fact that I'm still making progress, I will take it. I haven't did any exercise and I haven't really changed my food in the last two weeks. I haven't been eating as much, but I haven't changed what I'm eating. So I'm going to try to... um. So this week I'm going to incorporate exercise. I'm going to start back. I used to work out a lot and this life is happening and I'm running my own business and just been on the go. I'm raising a three-year-old. So it's just a lot, but I got to make time for workout. So this week I'm going to at least, if I can at least get two or three days a weekend for now, just at least start exercising, and walking, doing something. That's my goal. So my goal this week is to get to moving, okay, and then increasing my protein um, and drinking more water. My mouth, I definitely am having a dry mouth. Other than that, no real symptoms other than just the what I told you as far as I was a little lightheaded after the first, the last dose, and that I had some dealing with some constipation, which kind of not too much, so much now that I've I'm taking the um Mag O seven um medication. So other than that, I'm doing great. Like listen, I'm not trying to get caught up in the drama of the pharmacy. Like I I am caught up in it, but I'm not like letting it consume me. Cause listen, I just I'm I'm moving forward. Like I just want to keep getting it. Hopefully they keep using my old car and I don't have issues. And I'm just. I'm just trying to stay positive and know that this the whole thing is going to work out and I'm just going from week to week. Listen, if I can get that medication next week on the 18th, which is next Friday, that's four more weeks I got to worry about the next one. So that's where I'm at. And I hope you guys stay positive out there and stay tuned and let's just do this together and keep a positive environment. All that negativity, I can't take it. I'm not cut out for the negativity, Lord. So listen, we just got to stay positive. Let's keep uplifting each other and you guys have a wonderful, wonderful weekend.